You have spoken, and I am here to give you the cooler flip through. Now, please bear with me. I am not as skilled in the flip throughs as Danielle Stitcherista. I will do my best. I've done a couple. So this is the best of Cooler Design Studios Cross Stitch Collections from designers Linda Gillum, Barbara Bates Hillman, Sandy Orton, Nancy Rossi, and it's a Leisure Arts publication. We're going to have a little bit of glare, but we will do our best. So, this was published in Two thousand eleven copyright, just so you know, because I don't know if there's there might be multiple. I don't know. So there's a table of contents with pictures of the designers in the very front, which is nice. It's a nice difference from a lot of the other books. It gives you general instructions on how to do cross stitch. Most of us already know, but you know, if you are new and wanted to try. That is nice. It gives you um, really nice graphics on uh, the basic stitch designs. And then we have our first chapter, and it's Linda Gillum. And I please bear with me if I'm pronouncing the words wrong, you know, or the names. So the first one is a nice one. It's a tale of three fish. So you get on, and what's nice about this book is that you have the color key on one side, you have the stitched up picture on the other side, and there's your tail of three fish. And then on the, on the consecutive pages after that is your, your pattern. And all of these seem to be at least most of them seem to be black and white patterns, but then the back stitch is different color lines, if that makes sense. Next is the kiss of the sun. It's a nice sun and sunflower design. Again, you have the color key on the side and the stitched up frame piece on the complementary side. Bless the animals. Zoo or Noah's Ark like design. We're gonna lose the sun a little bit, must have just gone behind the, the clouds. We're gonna do our best. I'm hoping to get through this before it gets too dark. One can never have too many cats. Cute cat pattern. Different cats there. We have a Yankee Doodle Dandy, so a horse, uh, carousel horse, patriotic carousel horse. So far, none of these are ones that I would stitch. There are a few farther back that I would stitch. Then we have Animals Came, two by two. So here's our Noah's Ark. That's a cute one. There's some nice animal motifs in there. I like those pandas in the bottom corner. And what's nice about this one is the patterns are nice and large, so you don't have to worry about it being a print pattern. We have Willow Wear Classic. Tabletop still life.
Nice as there's a lot of patterns in this book. Summertime sampler. And that one you could do a few of the motifs into ornaments. And then we get into Barbara Bates Hillman. So again, there's a little introduction on the designer, some pictures of what's to come. We have a perfect peony, so the one that is on the front of the book. I do like that one. Would I stitch it? Maybe. Probably not, because there's a lot more other things that I would rather stitch. But who knows? The other nice thing about this book is that the pattern doesn't go really far down into the crease of the book. So it's it's fairly far out here, so you don't have to worry about having to crease open the book very far. This is called my favorite hat collection. You know, I kind of feel like I've seen somebody else. It's one of our floss, stitch, floss tubers doing this design or something very similar. I'm not sure though, I can't remember. Again, a lot of the, some of those could be used as ornament maybe like spring ornaments. Here is spring fever, lots of birds and flowers again. Some of them could be pulled apart to be ornaments or smalls. Nice sampler. Okay, sorry, I'm getting a little floppy with the book here. We have a nice Celtic angel. I kind of like this for a for an angel. I'm not really much of the angels or the women, but that's kind of neat, different. I like the halo. And then we have, oh, here, let's use this. Crate labels carrots. So this is a small one. There we go. And then after carrots is lemons. I do like this lemons. That might be a fun small to do sometime. I wouldn't mind doing that on something like black maybe. And have those colors pop. Oh, and guess what? There's another one. How about tomatoes? Tomatoes, tomatoes. And then we have Oriental Kimono. Hollow Fendi. That's a nice one. I do like that, that floral design on that kimono. Very unique and different. Something you, I, I don't, I haven't seen anything like that. I know there's other kimono designs out there. That's, that's different. I like those colors on that one. Then we have Country Nastrum. do half the book today i will have another half another day and so that's the first two designers in the cooler design studios best of go check it out i purchased my copy at joe and fabric so part two will be out in the next couple days see you later